What's up, Airsoft? This is Troy with GNG Armin here at Shop Show 2020 with Airsoft Mastery. And checking out the new products from us this year. Uh, right behind me, we have our light, or fully licensed Cold Kinetics gun. This is actually out already. Big takeaway is the magazine auto automatically drops, so for quicker reloads on the fly, this is able to accommodate you. The technology is in, inside the magazine, so you're able to buy this magazine separately and use it with a different rifle that you might have. Uh, moving down later on, we're going to be releasing in about two months is our SBR Mark One and Mark Two. They take our 308 platform, but make it more for short uh, rail and outer barrel for CQB play. Uh, the Mark One is going to be designed more for a 9.6 uh, nunchuck battery, and the Mark Two is going to be designed more for 11.1 uh, lipo stick battery here. And uh, right below is the uh, highly anticipated SMC9 that is actually released already and we'll get another shipment in the US uh, next month so if you didn't get your chance to order one make sure you pre-order one at airsoftmaster.com moving down this rack we got part of the most hated yet loved rifle of 2020 and that would have to be the G&G SSG1 so uh, I talked briefly about these guns back last year in the summertime in Taiwan and I'm happy to announce that we're going to actually make the full production of these. So you're going to have all these with electronic trigger units inside. So you have a three round burst along with a pre installed MOSFET. And as you can see, we're going to offer them in a different array of colors. So whatever your style of gameplay is, you can kind of customize your kit to match your gun as well. And uh, technically, we don't have a release date, but we're trying to launch these around the summertime. Uh, the price is unknown just yet, so you can make sure you can see these out your indoor arenas pretty soon. Uh, moving down, we have the ARP9 version of the AK series. So we have the PRK9, the PRK RTS, and the PRK9L. Uh, the PRK9L is featured with the drum mag. It's going to be sold separately, but we wanted to feature that uh, magazine to kind of show you guys what it looks like with the drum mag. The drum mag right now roughly fits around 1730 rounds inside, and uh, these will be available in about two, three months from now. So by April, March, you'll see them on the market. Now moving this way, we got our new Japanese style rifle, the Type 64 BR. And what's really nice, we do attention to detail. We have the Japanese flower with the nice uh, detail markings here. It comes uh, real wood and full metal. It comes with the bipod as well. You're able to dis disengage it and mount it. And then you have the hop of adjustment up here where the gas block is so you just make a couple changes and the hop adjustment moves up and down accordingly and also the big takeaway from this gun is that there is a wireless remote that will be included in the rifle and this uses the same type it's a slightly a version 3 gearbox modified so it's not really an AK uh, gearbox but we kind of modify a little bit so we have a upgraded ETU and MOSFET in there similar to the G2 uh, MOSFET so you'll be able to program it for a three round or five round burst as well. You could do that manually with holding the trigger in semi for 10 seconds and then flipping it in full auto. However, with the remote, you could do wirelessly connect your gun with the remote and do that wirelessly with the remote. So that's a nice little cool feature that we have on there. All right, as you can tell, we have an array of pistols on this wall here and we're really happy because we're really doubling down on our pistol line. Uh, moving down this side, we have the GTP9s, which were already released, which is the black tan, black and tan, the black and gray. Uh, last year, we came out with the GTP9 rose gold, but we've actually kind of uh, made a more metallic look to it. So it has a nice uh, pop in it. And in my opinion, it makes it look much better than the previous uh, model that we showed last year at SHOT Show. And uh, these are our full auto GTP9s. Uh, this is our Piranha series and what's unique about this is that it features a fixed uh, barrel, outer barrel, so that way you get more consistent and accurate shots out of the, when you're shooting it as opposed to your relatively normal uh, pistols that have, uh, uh, it kind of flares up when you shoot it, so this one's more consistent because it's fixed and uh, these will be available probably sometime later this year. We don't have any pricing or, or uh, ETA just yet, but we're working on these. Uh, these are our competition style pistols, which are gonna be like kind of like the high kappas and different color schemes, different grips, to kind of really accommodate uh, different players out there that are looking for some, some customization in their gameplay. And moving to the, down to the left side, we have our GPM-92. 
We released our GPM92 uh, previously, but we came out with a new version of the GP2, uh, and the biggest difference is that it comes with a nice uh, bullet uh, keychain, and you're able to adjust the hop up on the outer, outer barrel, similar to the GTP9. So you make that adjustment as you see, like this here, you just make the adjustment inside, and uh, actually, let me uh, take it out for you guys. So you grab it, you make the adjustment, and then you're good to go. You make in game adjustments much easier and much quicker to get you back in the fight. And uh, we also have a nice uh, all gold stainless steel and gold trim. And that pretty much wraps up Shot Show 2020, guys. If you guys are interested in any products, make sure you check out airsoftmaster.com to pre order any of the upcoming rifles. And I'll see you guys next time.